All right, just finished up this 120 the, um, that I've been working on for about two months. I could have got done a lot quicker, but I've been working on getting the food truck off the ground and had my first two pop-ups with that. Went awesome, sold out both times. First one, like two and a half hours. The next one was like three and a half hours, uh, which probably just means I need to bring a little bit more food next time. But anyway, I'm gonna do a quick walk around on this 120 and kind of show you what's up with it. Anybody interested in something like this, you can hit me up, uh, email me through the website. Um, you can just find me on Instagram, whatever you want to do, DM me, ask me any questions you got. I'll answer them for you. So this is a 120 gallon pit. <clears throat> this is a 30 by 24 firebox. The whole thing's quarter inch steel. Um, it's, I built it for a different project and ended up not using it. So it is, uh, I figured I'd use it on this and it came in real handy. It's an awesome firebox. Got the, whoop, <laughs> on a little hill here. Got the V bottom in the bot, uh, in there. Get your fire going really nice. See how deep it is. So you can kind of see how it, I did the opening throat like that. Um, something new I'm trying on this smaller style cooker just to see how the heat distribution works out on it. I did, I did, uh, build this like i said built this firebox a long time ago but it's a uh, perfect size for this one i think it's gonna work real well because you'll be able to push your fire back in a little bit farther and not have it so close as like say a 24 by 24 and this thing will be rocking steady across the whole entire cook chamber so anyway um you have about a 48 inch on the dot across on this main cook rack i do not have a second shelf in it if somebody wanted a second shelf i could do a second shelf for them it just depends on what you what you like there we go doors easy to open so you can see in there 24 inch cook chamber by 48 inch rack throw it right there as you can see i like to build myself a little bit oversized smoke collector and then i always use a seven inch stack this one here is four feet tall but this thing in the sunlight man it's got some really cool patina the way I did this this patina compared to other ones I've done in the past got some really neat uh, parts of the um, uh, primer on bottom coming through. Let's see if you, can, you maybe see a little bit better one over here. There you go. Yeah, thing looks awesome. It's one of my favorite to date. If I didn't already have a 150 in the backyard, I'd probably keep it. So, anyway, this thing's gonna be pretty badass. It has got an awesome style cook chamber. It will be uh, for sale once I get these thermometers put on. Anytime, DM me with questions you got. Let me know what you think.